Vanessa Monster, why are you so charged up on a red day? Because I already know what's coming from Mullen Automotive. Mm -hmm. Welcome back to the channel. It's your boy Finesse Monster. Thank y'all for tuning in for another video. If you're new to this channel, make sure you hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel so you get more content coming from me. The crooks came to play today, huh? We needed a little pullback, but I ain't expect that much. I was wrong on pushing towards $2 today with a continuation, bouncing off that trend line that I drew up for you guys. But like I said, I'm not an expert. And I have no problem admitting when I'm wrong. And you know this stock is heavily manipulated. And these short sellers know we got some big announcements locked and loaded to be released. So they're going to do whatever they can to keep this price down. Now they may have scared some day traders out. But I know my millionaires out there are holding strong and staying charged up. The 24th and the 30th of June is getting very, very close now. And you could tell by the price action that these short sellers and market makers are running out of time. Now let's take a quick look at the options chain. This week, 24 June, the market makers are most likely pinging for the $1.50 calls, over 10,000 open interest. They're going to try to make sure those expire out of the money. I'm glad there's not that many weekly options being purchased by us millionaires. We've been hitting that topic for a long time now. However, though, the July 15th call options may be a better option and they are stacked up right now. Now, I told you all in one of my previous videos that June 24th, the last Friday of the month, will be a high volume day due to the Frank Russell FTSE index reconstitution. Now, you all know if you haven't known that Mullen Automotive gets listed on the Russell 2000 and 3000 on june 27th so let's talk a little bit about the reconstitution process and what it means each year in may and june the russell indexes release an updated list of the constituents for their various indexes notably the russell 2000 and the russell 1000 many exchange traded funds etfs and mutual funds are constructed to track these indexes so official index rebalances force these funds to transact large volumes of stocks that move in or out of the index this drives major changes in demand for stocks generated significant volatility the russell 3000 growth index in contrast is composed of those companies well positioned for fast growth growth stocks often look expensive trading at high pe ratio but such valuations actually could be cheap if the company continues to grow rapidly which will drive the share price drive up the share price these fast growing firms often startups do not always pay a dividend given that management usually opts to reinvest retained earnings and capital projects. For this reason, growth investors choose growth stocks based on the potential for capital gains, not dividend income. Here's another good tip headed in tomorrow's trading day. Because they are closely followed by mutual fund managers and individual investors, speculation as to which companies will be added or removed to, from the Russell 1000 and 2000 can cause a jolt in short-term demand. Now, we already discussed that these institutions have been loading up with anticipation of all these catalysts coming. And today's price action, if I could describe it, was just a slight pullback from the run-up that we've been doing with some illegal attacks by these short sellers on the pullback to try to drive us down as much as possible. And we saw shills and bots just flooding the message boards. Well, $1.40 per share held, even though we broke it slightly. And that's looking good going into tomorrow and next week. Yahoo Finance says Mullen Automotive issues update to shareholders. These things covered in this article are things we already know. The good things about Mullen is coming. I love these type of articles because it's pretty much telling us that we're good. There's nothing to worry about. Whatever they do to the price, we already know what's coming from Mullen Automotive. So I'm just reassuring you guys that this is what you need to be focused on instead of all the nonsense out there. So that's all I got for this video. Y'all already know I'm charged. I'm ready for this wealth transfer. And if y'all are too, 
Let me get that. Three, two, one. Mm -hmm. Stay charged up. I'll catch you on the next video. I'm gone.